Okay, students. So in this question, an electron is accelerated through a potential difference of 2.5 mega volt. What is the change in kinetic energy of the electron? Fine. So this is a straightforward question, and there is a straightforward formula for this. But I would be deriving that formula here in front of you so that you will get the background concept, the background theory of the numerical also. So what is actually happening is there are two electrodes. There are these two electrodes and let us say this end is positive, this end is negative. So a very big battery is applied here. This is a setup which is used to accelerate the charged particles like electron. So we are using this now. Let us say there is an electron here and the initial velocity for this is zero. This is the voltage V. Okay. And this is the charge E. So what happens is the gap between this is L. The gap here is L. So now, okay, this electron will be acted upon by a force. There will be an electric field here and that force will be Q into E. E is the electric field which is going from positive to negative side. So this electron is getting pushed here. So this is the force. So F is equal to Q into E. And this E will be given by V by L. Where L is the gap between the plates, V is the potential. These all are the formulas that we have done in electrostatics. Okay. So I'm just going into little deep method. Otherwise, you can skip the method and you can directly apply the formula also to get the answer. I will be telling you that also. Just give me two minutes for this. So this is the force and what will be the acceleration? The acceleration will be Q into V divided by L divided by the mass of the electron. So this will be the acceleration. Now, V is equal to U plus AD. No, we will apply the formula V square minus U square is equal to 2AS. U is zero. So V square is equal to two into A I'm keeping it A, S, the distance traveled by the electron will be L. So once it will, it will be uh, moving through the distance L, it will increase its speed to V. From here, we can find V. But what I will do is, I will multiply this by half into M, into this, so that I would be directly getting the kinetic energy. How? So 2 into A into L into M divided by 2. So I have multiplied by M on both of sides and I have divided by 2 on both of the sides. So this becomes the kinetic energy and so it will become M, A and L. And what is A? Now I will put the value A, Q, V by M, L. So there you can see a very simple formula for kinetic energy final. Initial kinetic energy is zero. So I can say this is the change in kinetic energy. So from here, I directly jump to this conclusion that change in kinetic energy is given by the product of charge and V, the potential difference. So it will be the charge Q into delta V because delta V is the potential difference that is applied across the electrodes. So this is a very simple formula. Now, now we can directly apply this and we will find the change in kinetic energy. So what is the charge? Charge on electron is 1.6 into 10 to the minus 19. And the voltage applied is 2.5 into 10 to the power 6. As I have told you earlier, we can directly apply the formula to get the answer. We have done that. So now this is coming out to be 1.6 multiply by 2.5 is 4 into 10 raised to power minus 13 minus 12 joule. So this is pico. So it will become pico joule. So definitely our answer should be C. Let us verify from the mark scheme. And yes, the answer is C. So to do this question, you can do two things. One is to understand the complete concept and do the complete thing every time. And the other thing is to apply the formula. So with this, all the best.